Hi, and welcome to Bear Cub Scrap Room with Jenny and Gabby at BearCubsScrapRoom.blogspot.com. Today's project, Gabby and I are going to show you to make some projects using some CDs, some craft foam, some pom-poms, some ribbon for this particular one. And then this one over here, the little snowman, has some similar items, but it also has a pipe cleaner on it. So to begin with, um, what we thought we'd do is show you some of the um, pieces and how we were able to, to make those things. For the snowman, um, what we found the best oh, your pain. Um, what we found best was the 12 by 18 craft foam sheets. Um, we've laid a couple of the little hats out. We started out with cardstock paper to make the pattern with. So this is the hat and then this is going to be the brim. I know it's going to be hard to see, but um, let me show you what it'll look like otherwise. So you kind of get an idea. Anyways, um, if you're planning on having some kids around for the holiday season like many of us do, um, this is a great project to keep those little ones busy while things are cooking or guys are and moms are talking or whatever's going on. Families, it's family time. So anyway, so um, you'll need some 12 by um, 18 craft uh, foam sheets. I found at Michael's for a dollar. These little um, sticky adhesive little craft foam pieces for the decorating of it. Some apple barrel paint, white and black. Um, you can get the small ones, it goes with quite a ways. The black one is going to be used for the wooden, wooden one inch uh, disc. There, um, in a little package, there was probably 12 to 15 in the package. Um, in some of the packages, these are for the eyes for the snow person. Anyways, um, and then some cheesecloth, which Gabby's using white paint to paint the CD. And <laughs> she just got me. Isn't that funny? Good thing. Anyways, um, and then you'll need some pipe cleaner. The pipe cleaner gets cut for four inches. Um, but that's to make this. So um, you lay out the pieces on there. You cut them out with um, some scissors is good. We just drew them up with some uh, pencil and then started putting it together. The CDs get glued side by side to one another, but then in the process of putting the glue onto the CD with the heat, heat glue gun, um, this part of the hat for the bottom gets put in. So it's this part of the bottom mixed in between the two parts of the top of the CD. Alright, and then for the next one, while Gabby's paint is drying, I'm going to go ahead and show you this project. Um, for this reindeer, which is suspended on fishing line, you need two CDs and then one sheet of the um, 12 by 18 craft foam, the brown, will cover three of the antlers, which is here, for that pattern. And that's how I laid them out to get three of them on there. You need four googly eyes. Um, these are half inch ones. And then two red pom poms, and they were, I think, an inch. And then 12 inches of ribbon, two pieces. And then um, for that, we'll get started with that. Or Gabby's paint's drying. Gabby, if you wouldn't mind. You want to check it so that you have just enough of the top of this to have the points stick out in the ear so they kind of look like they're separate pieces so it'll go like into there. And I'll get some Google eyes out for it. The reason to have that triangle stick out is so that you can just poke a little sewing needle through there to put your fishing line up on there so that that way it hangs up in either the window or dining room light or whatever you guys are going to use it for. But anyways, they look great in the little classrooms too. Should I put the other side on? Yeah, you can put the other side on. 
And here's four eyes. So I'm just going to make a little bow. I know it's not Christmassy color, but that's okay because I sometimes am not into the traditional red greens and whatever. But anyways, you need two of those. Yes, please. And then if you notice in the center of the CD here, there's still craft foam there. That's okay. We're going to put the red nose on that. If you want to cut it out, that's up to you. Um, it doesn't really make any difference. Let me just tighten this little bow up and get a quick little snippies there and let me get a pom pom out. And that's what the reindeer looks like. This. Take this piece and just put a little strip of glue on it. Across the bottom. And you pick up the shiny side. Put it on like that. Look at that. Try to match it up. Take your rim of the hat and put a little circle bowl in the middle. Gabby and I were asked to come and teach a class to daycare providers because um, my mom has a home daycare. Anyways, um, so we said, okay, you know, what did they want? And they kind of said, you know, something that was easy somewhat to do with the kids and stuff. So we thought that these little stickers would be all right. Um, we realized that the kids can't handle the glue guns. But um, with that, um, the, the teacher can do, you know, the providers or whatever could do while the kids were taking the rest or something like that and have it ready for when they get up so that um, they would have something to do for that activity. And these are something that can hang up. Um, during the week prior to them going home for the parents to um, take. So anyway, so um, the moment that my mother had seen the examples that Gabby and I had been working on, she thought that that was a great idea. So she called a few of her friends up and they said that they would love to do this. We have foam pumpkins from a bucket of foam. They're already pre-cut out. You just cut the stem off and you fold it in half. And you put it in the center of the CDs. Pull it through so it's about even. That's the carrot nose. You need a smiley face on there. Yeah, we need pipe cleaners. Just bend the pipe cleaners a little bit. Put a little dot of hot glue in the middle at the ends. Anyways, and then these also will get the fishing line on them also. Um, 
and get hung up. I thought that that was really kind of cool. But anyway, so um, we hope you like our project, and we have a couple other things coming up in the near future to show you. Um, we, we were going to do another class with these ladies um, to make some mini coaster books, and what we'll do is we'll save that for another video from today. But anyways, um, well, we hope you have a great day, and we'll see you soon. Thank you.